Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Brittany. So in today's video, I have I have another synthetic wig review for you guys, but I'm going to be featuring two wigs in this video. So shout out to Hair So Fly for gifting me these wigs. So I, Bobby Boss, they released this Truly Me line last year and I reviewed one of their wigs and it was in a blue color and I really did not like that wig. Um, that was like the first stinker in a long time and if you don't know like my rating scale anything that's like below a six like a six and below is a stinker that's like a wig i would not recommend um so i hope since last year they have made some advancements and these wigs are better so i'm reviewing andrina and marcia so okay I looked up to make sure I was saying, pronouncing it right. I thought it was Marcia, but then I saw some other, other people online pronouncing it Marcia, but I thought it was Marcia. So let me see which one is which now. So first up, I'm gonna show you guys Marcia. And what they claim with this line is that it's ready to wear a natural lace front, hand tied, it has, a it has a hand tied lace part and it has an effortless style to it. So um, it has a top quality cap and it's heat safe. It doesn't say up to what degree, but yeah. So this is what Marsha looks like on the stock card. Very cute. And I wanted to try this because this to me looked like it was probably going to be like a regular lace front wig that I could just wear with a wig grip and keep it moving. Um, and I have it in the color TT2 slash 3273. And I don't think I've ever reviewed a wig in that color before. So I'm going to take my wig grip off so I can see what size cap this is. Okay, so the lace on this is brown. You guys can see that. So this is going to work really well with um, deeper complexions. This is what the parting space looks like. Looks like you get about uh, three, three and a half inches of parting space, which I don't mind. Uh, this is the color here. It has some barrel curls in there. The dark root is not throughout, but um, it stops about right there. Here's the inside of the cap. You see the parting space will come on the right and left side a comb in the back and adjustable straps. Feels like it's gonna be a small cap, but we'll see. Okay, um, first impression, I'm definitely gonna have to use my blow dryer to get the top flat. Um, it feels like the cap is probably small. Let me zoom out. The cap feels a little bit small, but I'm gonna go ahead and cut the lace off of this one as well as the other wig. Um, so I can see how it fits. Okay, I wanted to go ahead and cut the lace off just to make sure I could assess what the cap size was. It feels like it's on the smaller side, but not like too small, small to medium cap at most. Um, I'm gonna put my wig grip on though because I don't plan on like using any got to be glue because this is like a simple wig and the lace is laying pretty flat on my head so i'm gonna put my wig grip on and go ahead and get to work on this wig which i think this might be pretty straightforward
guys so I'm back I have applied Marsha and I'm going to try to make this quick because um, my camera is dying and I want to make sure I have enough time for the second wig so with Marsha this color is very very beautiful uh, this is my kind of blonde I don't like 613s that much on me um, I like when they're a bit more understated like this yeah so I like that this is a bit more understated again the dark root is it yeah it doesn't go all the way throughout the wig but that doesn't bother me this length is about I don't know 22 inches long so this is a longer wig um, it might make you hot I mean it's the summertime anything that's long and not super thin is probably gonna make you hot but just consider that I'm one of those people that will probably I will wear Nisha original Nisha during the summertime so I don't really care about that too much so this is a very beginner friendly wig all I had to do was I pulled a little bit of hair out of the parting space so the parting space is kind of a con because it was a little bit tight so I did pull some hair out of there but all I really did was put some powder in the part and that's it and I do have on my wig grip yeah I do have on my wig grip because I wanted to wear it glueless I didn't want to have to glue it down yeah so this is a very simple wig if you are looking for something that gives you this glamorous vibe I feel like this is glamorous but also it looks kind of boho a little bit has a little beachy vibe to it it kind of reminds me of like a longer version of Valentino some more cons outside of the parting space being kind of tight. The top of the wig was very humpy. So I used my blow dryer and my hot comb to make sure it was nice and sleek. Something else I do have tangling with this wig, but it's to be expected because it's synthetic and it's long. I am getting some shedding, but it's not excessive. Um, it's just a couple of strands every time I, you know, pull at the ends or run my hands through it. This is not a yakky texture, but it's um, not super silky either. It's kind of in between. It has a very nice luster to it. it. You know how it just has a nice luster to it. It doesn't look shiny. Yeah, I think this is easy. I did have a little bit of baby hair action at the beginning, but then I was like, oh, I don't like how it looks. Um, so I just kind of pulled it back a little bit on my forehead. So it's on. it's like slightly behind my hairline, but I don't really have my edges out. I just put it slightly behind my hairline because I just wanted to give the wig a bit more space on my forehead. Overall, I think Marsha is nice overall. Really, I do. Just make sure you work on, make sure your hair is braided flat. Mine is pretty flat underneath with some old cornrows and use your hot tools to make sure it's smooth. So overall, Marsha for me is like, I don't know, probably eight and a half, nine. Um, I don't really have too many issues with it and it's easy so I'm gonna switch to Andrina I'm just gonna go ahead right into styling and then I'll come back with a review
right guys so i'm back and i have on i have on andrina and i have this color the color i have is fs4 slash 2730 so the application process was just the same as marcia's so i didn't like include that pretty much i did show i do have some footage of what this looks like as a side part with straight part wigs you can usually ship them this is very similar to the other wig i feel like this has a bit more texture to it like it feels like it's more yakky than that so the luster is very low and very natural this chocolate brown color is very pretty but as far as cons with this wig i think the curls are weird like some of the curls in here i just don't like how it is i feel like it has a little bit of wigginess to it uh yeah and it's kind of throwing me off i do prefer marcia over this one i don't have i don't have much shedding at all but i do have a little bit of tangling i don't know it just looks too perfect and it looks like a wig to me even though it has this beautiful yakky texture it just kind of looks like a, a wig to me yeah and i feel like the curls are going in a weird direction in some parts yeah, this one is like a seven, seven and a half, um, even though I like the color of it. I think I want to cut it and see if I feel any better about it. Just like with the other wig, I feel like this is on, this is small to medium, but it's not like going to give me, I don't think it will give me a headache. It, I think it's small to medium. Um, there's tons of wigs that have this body wave middle part look. Um, I'm just not too crazy about this one in comparison with... Marsha. So this one is a seven and a half. Probably not a wig I'm gonna keep, but this is my wig, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut it and see what it's like. so here is it you know cut shorter it's still okay to me I, i'm just i'm cool off um andrina that's just my opinion but um but marcia wasn't too bad i like that one this one was just kind of weird for me so if you are interested in either one of these you can head over to hair so fly i'll have some links in the description box for you guys they are affiliate links so if you do purchase through those you do help help my channel uh so purchase through those links shout out to hair so fly for sending me both of these wigs and shout out to you guys for tuning in to another video thank you so much and i will see you guys in the next video bye guys